Hi there, Ian Dixon here. How are you doing today? Right, at the time of recording, uh, it's the 30th of March uh, 2020. So if you're watching this video in years to come, it may not have any relevance. But what I want to share with you today, if you're a business owner, uh, we're at the early kind of lockdown stage of the whole uh, coronavirus uh, challenge. Um, uh, what, what I want to share with you literally in three to four minutes is a series of videos that is around things that you can do right now while you're sat at home um, thinking about you know what can I do so um, there are so many businesses that have essentially shut down and so there's nothing coming in and it's kind of a waiting game and certainly as, as at the time of this video uh, being uh, published, uh, there is no indication at all really uh, as to how long we're gonna be in this position for. So, so what I wanted to do was just put together a short series of videos of things that you can do right now uh, that would uh, give you some focus and uh, certainly some direction and some things that you can very specifically do. And literally one per video. So this is only gonna be three or four minutes. So if that's of interest to you, stick around. If you are somebody that's new to the channel, please do support us with a press on the subscribe. Um, without further ado, so I was challenged to um, support a, a Facebook group last week uh, with a challenge, a, a daily challenge. And so uh, what I challenged them with is, is what I'm gonna share with you. So the idea is to seek out 10 people. Who are these 10 people? <clears throat> They're in two groups of five. And the first five people that I would challenge you to seek out are five individuals that you want to be there with you. This is in a, a business capacity. Uh, five business people that you want to be there with you when you're ready for uh, the new way. You know, so when we come back to uh, uh, business, who are your five supporting agencies? It could be uh, a web developer, it could be an accountant, a bookkeeper, it could be a marketeer, it could be somebody that you collaborate with or do joint ventures with, it could be your business coach, but seek out five individuals and the idea is that you communicate with them that they've been identified as five key people that you want to make sure are there ready with you and for you when we get to the other side and work with them in a collaborative way to make sure that you are very specifically supporting each other so that you are best prepared and ready for the recovery. So there's the first five. And then the second five uh, individuals are very similar to the first five, but you don't tell them. So uh, the other five individuals or five businesses or people within those uh, companies are people that you recognize are gonna be important to you, uh, the other side. And uh, that, you know, my guess is that these are people that already pre-exist in your network. It may not be. Um, you know, if we're, I've been talking to business owners about um, you know, reinvention and being creative and uh, going off in a different direction. And so there may be new people that you want to have uh, within your extended team. So, so the second five are five people that you recognize and acknowledge are going to be helpful and useful to you. And then the idea is you start to make a conscious effort to support them without them knowing what it is that you're doing. So it could be clicking a like, uh, commenting or sharing LinkedIn, Facebook, Insta, whatever uh, social platform it's on. Uh, it could be you know, sending them something in the post. Um, it could be offering to support them in all sorts of different ways. Uh, but behind the scenes, the it's, it, the, it's not a hidden agenda. Well, it is kind of a hidden agenda, but essentially uh, in the background, you have an ulterior motive. Now, um, basically that ulterior motive is what you want to be doing is loading up their emotional bank. Start to do things to support them so that uh, when we get into recovery mode and on the assumption that 
a lot of us are going to be uh, short on funds is that if you've been doing some things to help load these people's emotional banks and then you're, you need or want to ask for a favor, they're far more likely to uh, either move you up the list or help and support you in what it is that you're doing. If over the last six to nine months you have been doing stuff, you know, whether it be likes, shares, comments, uh, just being generally supportive and just slowly chip away and then what each time every thumb up every comment every share is just the tiniest small deposit in their emotional bank and just keep aware of how um, in credit you are with them against you know any kind of emotional uh, uh, bank emotional bank deposits they may be making on you because when we come back, you wanna be able to call upon their services or their support, knowing that you are so in credit with them, the likelihood of them saying or saying no to you or pushing away is, is greatly reduced. So, so there you go, uh, just five minutes. It's 10 people that you identify that are gonna be important to you when we get into recovery phase. What we're looking for are five people that you um, identify and you're going to contact them and tell them that they are special and that they've been identified as, as key people for you and you want to do whatever you can to be able to support them uh, to make sure that that relationship is strong and that they are best placed to be able to support you when the recovery comes and then the second five is to find five people whose emotional banks you can start making deposits in so that if you need to call a favor or you need to ask for some help at the very least you're further up the list but actually what you could end up doing is calling on a favor that is a complete freebie because you've spent time loading their emotional bank i hope you found that useful we're going to do uh, one a day we're going to do some random short things that you can do now you don't have to be waiting to do this on the contrary these are the kind of things that take time to uh, manifest so you really want to be starting these things now just grab a piece of paper and get yourself a list of 10 uh, companies or individuals and proactively seek out these people and contact them or start to make deposits in their emotional bank oh god we have literally uh, there's over 100 videos around you right now and there is going to be at least 300 more over the next 12 months business videos that are here to help and support you at any time in your business uh, but no more important than where we are right now uh, as of march 2020 so please do support us with a click on the subscribe of course if you enjoyed the video we welcome your comments uh, and a share would be fabulous too uh, we look forward to catching up with you on the next video bye for now